crazy because last year I was watching Jackson State in the championship game and me and my dad was sitting there. I'm like, man, I wish I could play for Coach Prime. And it was crazy just hitting the portal and just having that, uh, that conversation with them within like the first 48 hours. It was a dream come true. So I knew as soon as I got that call, I was like, yeah, I'm coming straight to Colorado. There's no question about it. Robert Hewitt student, safety, number 29, Roderick Ward. There's a little finger right there on that line that I'm at. Okay, so I'll just adjust it. Okay, what you do, we got two jumps. If you hit it on your second jump, we'll give you a third. All right, the big thing, get up under there and just tap it. Don't think about slapping it. All right, I want to go straight up, tap. Straight up, tap. All right, all good? Just no double jump, watch your feet. Make sure that you don't jump and then jump. There you go. Oh, oh. This when you look at it. Uh, like, uh, 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 That's some good Craig 
falls on the ball. Now it's a scrub. He had it in his hands as it popped up into the air. See if he maintained possession to the ground. But football over. There he is again running downhill. Like I said, it almost looks like a replay of the play that Shiloh Sanders made earlier. Puts his shoulder right on the football, pops out. Colorado gets on top of it, prevents UCLA from getting more points here before the half. They have the four turnovers, only three points off those turnovers. Silman. I'm Tom, presented by Aflac. Get help with expenses that health insurance doesn't cover. Visit Aflac.com to learn more. Back at the Post Chicken and Beer, our final segment, our player segment, safety, Roderick Ward joining us here for a few minutes. <laughs> Young man out of California. And uh, we were just talking during the break. Your last home game, or your final season of college football, happens in a blink of an eye, doesn't it? Most definitely, man. Um, it feels like yesterday I was just a freshman. Yeah. Uh, playing at JUCO, you know, uh, it's crazy, man. Playing at JUCO, it's kind, of, it's kind of scary, but at the same time, it's a maturity thing. I know uh, when I went to JUCO, I was only 17. Wow. And I seen dudes that was 22, 21. <laughs> and I'm like, yo, dad, well, like, what is this? Yeah. Like, man, you You're a kid it. and they're grown men. Yeah. yeah. But uh, no, nah, man, it, it feels like it was just yesterday, man. I was just telling my teammates, like, man, it flies. Yeah. Take advantage of all the moments and uh, just in, just embrace it all, man. It, it, it happens in the blink of an eye. You're going to have uh, you're gonna a little emotional maybe on on Saturday when you run out there? Yeah, most definitely. Yeah. But that's the thing. I'm kind of emotional every game. Um, but uh, Well, why is nah. Coach Dancy uh, bobbing his head up and down? He's agreeing with you. Yeah, He's an emotional coach, coach is coach he? Coach Dancy, you know. Yeah. 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 Um, no, nah, it, it'll be a little emotional. My pops and my mom's going to be out there. Nice. So just sharing that moment with them is going to be uh, really emotional. Yeah. Most definitely. I, I'd imagine you, you're, you're a young man. You, you play football your whole life, right? And, and you're probably talking to your dad and mom about that. And so having them here is going to be awful special. I mean, for them to see the way you played, the way you've grown as a, as a young man, that's got to mean something to you. Oh, yeah, most definitely, man. Um, my mom, my mom, she was always the one that was scared of me playing football. So yeah. I know on the back of my head, I'm like, I got to make sure I can't get hurt. My mom's yeah. going to yeah. my mom to be gotcha. uh, tripping. But no, my dad, man, he's, a, he, he's the reason why I am how I am. I'm the reason, yeah. like, I'm a dog because of him. Yeah. You know, growing up when I was little, he had me in the front yard tackling <laughs> Uh, punching bags, trash cans, <laughs> just trying to toughen me up, man. But, uh, nah, man, they're great, man. Uh, their support and everything they've done for me along this way, man, is, it, does, it doesn't go unnoticed, man. I know um, that they know that I appreciate them for everything they yeah. have done for me, man. Who was the athlete? Where'd you get the athleticism from, mom or dad? Well, <laughs> you going to get me in trouble with this one, but okay. uh, my dad my dad was the athlete. Was um, he? Yeah, they always get into argument because my mom played volleyball and okay. track, and my dad was like, nah, man, she wasn't like that. <laughs> But uh, it comes to my dad, though, for sure, man. All right. Mr. and Mrs. Ward, I apologize for starting a family <laughs> fight. If you're watching today on the camera on social media, we, we apologize. Were you always a football guy? Did you, was you baseball, basketball, uh, track No, field? yeah, I was just straight football. Straight I tried football. to play basketball. My dad yeah. was like, nah, you ain't got it. So he was like, if you ain't dominant in it, we ain't going to play. We ain't going to play. So I just played strictly football. You know, we were talking to Coach Dancy. Th this defense has kept coming all season long, I think. You, you guys have, and there, there's been a stick to itiveness you guys have had. And you've worked your way into being one of the primary uh, guys out there as well. You, you like the way this unit's been progressing? Oh, yeah, most definitely, man. Um, every week I can see us coming together closer and closer, man. Yeah. Um, I feel like the the group we're all just we're we're starting to get to know each other and how each other plays and stuff like that, yeah. and uh, I think as a whole it just makes us better just knowing how we think and knowing where a certain player is going to be and how mm -hmm. they play and what they see and how they react. So, yeah, man, I've been loving it. I've been loving it all, man. This has got to be quite an experience. Uh, here you are in, in down in Cedar City, Utah, at Southern Utah, and you show up here, and it's a program with national attention and national prominence and everyone's talking about the buffaloes what's that been like for you it's been a dream come true man yeah. um i remember last year i was sitting at home and i was watching jackson state in the championship sure 
And me and my dad, I was sitting there, I was like, man, it sure would be nice to play on the stage with Coach Prime, man. And uh, just coming here in Boulder, man, it's just a dream come true. And playing for Coach Prime, it's like just, it's kind of crazy because I still feel like it's a so real moment. Like sometimes I have to pinch myself, like, bro, this is real life. Like right. Coach Prime is sitting right there. <laughs> right. But uh, <laughs> no, nah, man, I love it. I love the big stage. I love the lights, man. It's, it's been perfect, man. It's a dream come true. Awesome. He's been one of the great stories on the defensive side of the ball for the Buffaloes. Safety number 29. Right. Good luck this weekend. Appreciate it. All right. Safety, Robert Ward. The ball. It's been dark way too long in this place. That bright smile long gone been replaced. From ear to ear, I see that fear in your face. Tell me when the last time you feel safe, cause there's some evil people in the streets. Evil at your front door, creeping while you sleep. It's time to raise up, show that evil we ain't weak. We don't turn the other cheek, I can show you how to be strong. Come on, follow me. Heard you looking for a hero. Well, look up. No more running from the bad guy. I'ma stare him in the eye like, what's up? I know the journey got hard for a minute, but I ain't giving this up. Yeah, I got the heart of a champion. If I get knocked down, I get back up. We go through bad days, hard times, low pay, high crime, pathways to a life without sunshine. I'm the lifeline. With this life, I'm going to be the pipeline. Shining in the nighttime, bet on me to swoop down. I'm going to go toe to toe, already know that I'm never going to back down. Bet on me to stand tall. I take on anything for my crew. Bet I risk it all. Wicked, wicked people in the streets. Corruption in the politics and the police. It's time to raise up. Take a stand against the seat. We won't take a back seat. I can show you how to be strong. Come on, follow me. Heard you looking for a hero. Well, look up. No more running from the bad guy. I'ma stare him in the eye like, what's up? I know the journey got hard for a minute, but I ain't giving this up. Yeah, I got the heart of a champion. If I get knocked down, I get back up. 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 If I get knocked down, I'ma get back up. If I get knocked down, I'ma get back up. If I get knocked down, I'ma get back up. I'ma get back up. I'ma get back up. I'ma. Heard you looking for a hero. Well, look up. Yeah. No more running from that bad guy. Don't worry about it. Hey, come on, it's the coming out party. Yeah. It's the coming out party. Yeah. Everything I don't want, bro. It's coming out of this thing right here. Yeah. This is what I work for right here. It don't get no better than this. It don't get no better than this.